so mean. I know you're kidding. Come on, sit down. Not hot, hot. Not flaming gorgeous. I hate being just average, I have to tell you. Like, I have to change your opinion. I think you should just come and sit down. Flattery, I love it. Give me more. Come on, sit down so we can talk. Hey, what did I say? Don't take offense. Please, it's not my first language, obviously. But why did you come back here? Do you want to talk? I think you want to. Maybe you should just have a seat so we can talk, no? <clears throat> I think you're confused. Maybe you should go and just come back when you know what you want. Well, okay then. Please, come on over here. So, do you want to talk? I know what you mean. Fashion would be okay if it wouldn't be for those fashion people. I'm just a part-time model. I'm much more into theater. Do you like theater? Yeah, I can take it or leave it. It's certainly not my first love. My agent gets me whatever she can. But I'm much more involved in theater. Do you like theater? There's something kind of intriguing about it. It's like theater without words. As if you're putting on a play with no script, just costume. Do you like theater? Ooh, that's too bad. It's my passion. I write, direct. I'm in a play right now. It's a kid's piece. With lots of audience involvement. I think about it all the time. Well, actually, I'm thinking about it right now. Do you want to hear a bit? Well, I'm working on a kid's play, theater. It's kind of interactive. Well, maybe you'd like to hear some. Yes, that's it. I couldn't live without it. I'm involved in a play right now. I wrote myself. It's a kids' theater. It's kind of interactive. Maybe you'd like to hear some. No, no, no. You're right. That's a stupid idea. Got me kind of restless now. So probably I'll just go out and enjoy the party a bit. Want to come and do some dancing? Nah, I'm getting out of here. You'll never miss me. Let's go do some dancing. Great! Well, it's an interactive thing. I get the kids to cheer whenever they want the story to go positive. Or to boo if they want it to go negative. Keep quiet if they want it to keep moving. And you can indicate your choice any way you want. And I'll just respond accordingly. Are you ready? Are you sure you want to do this? Now you've got me very distracted. I'm just, I'm just going to get out of here before somebody comes and put me back on stage. I'm just going to go out and... This has been a lot of fun. Maybe I'll see you out there. The forest was dark and wolves were about. He passed through the forest and came to the sea. And there in the glade was the tower of the elves. He huddled in fear in a cave in the dark. The wolf king was wise and led him to safety. The water was dark and churning with serpents. At the edge of the sea was a beautiful castle. He went for a ride on a silver blue dolphin. The elves took him prisoner and put him in chains. The elves made him king and crowned him with gold. He soon heard the sound of a creature below. Escaping the cave, he got back to the forest. A magical bat came and gave him a jewel, but soon he got lost and hid in a cave. They seized him and took him to their undersea world. But he fell down a shaft and he was trapped in a cave. There lived the princess of beauty profound. The dolphin transformed into hundreds of serpents. It swam to a land with a beautiful castle. It swam up river to the tower of the elves, but he slipped from his bonds and fled to the forest. In time he was freed and fled to the ocean. He stayed there for years till by chance he escaped, but soon they grew jealous and put him in chains. He met a magician with wonderful powers. A terrible monster arose from the depths. The jewel was elvish, and he found himself captive. 
the jewel gave him wings and he flew to the seaside. There he was trapped in a cave in darkness. He escaped to the surface and swam to a castle. An army of elves went to war with the serpents. She cursed him and sent him alone to the forest. She sent him to meet with her friend, a magician, and he stayed there in joy till the end of his days. It changed once again and became a magician. The magician was evil and to darkness he sent him. But the magician, he left him alone in the forest. The magician was kindly and gave him a jewel. The boy was devoured and this story is over. He barely escaped and fled back to the forest. Well, that's enough of that. That's one of the smaller story webs. Usually the kids ask me to stop if they can't find an ending, but now I feel like partying a bit. Shall we dance? All right, you found an ending. It's nice. You want to try it again? Do you want to stop? Oh, certainement. Listen, I'm with you on that. I'm about to leave this place. Why don't we just go and do some dancing? Okay, you asked for it. There once was a child who went to the forest. Okay, I'll start again. There once was a child who went to the forest. You've got me very excited right now. I hope I'm not being rude, but the truth is, I would really want to make love to you right now. Shy, please. Come on. Will you come? Come on. Hey, where are you going? Was it something I said? I have a map need tomorrow morning. I have to get some sleep. Well, listen, this has been great. We have to do it again. Hello? Are you back to see me? Come on in. This is a private dressing room. Nobody will disturb us. Hot. Shh. Hey, it was sure nice to be with you. Actually, I hope I'll see you around. My play tonight. Well, it's very late and I suspect the party is being long gone. I have to get some sleep. I hate to just leave you like that, but I'm sure you'll be fine. Well, I'll see you around. Oh, hey, aren't you looking good? How about me? How am I looking? Good? It's nice to have a distraction. We're not having any of the fun of the party back here. Just a bunch of good-looking people taking their clothes off. Not much fun, eh? But are you a fashion fan? Here we go. 
Remember, when I pause, you indicate which way you want the story to go, and I'll respond accordingly. Now, keep in mind, usually there's music, I have costume and stuff, but okay, here we go. There once was a child who went to the forest.